As a kind of wrap-up question about this part of your career, you talked earlier about how important it is to do what you want to do uh, and how you didn't want exactly to be a hematologist, you didn't want exactly to be a cardiologist. In reflection, what exactly did you want to do? <laughs> I've never asked that question, but that's a good question. Let me tell you, I've given you a bit about that vascular disease story. We're going to talk at the next session about how I became interested in early development. That came about through the Institute for Advanced Research. Um, one of the things that came up was I pushed the health agenda, which I hinted at the very beginning. How does the social environment get under the skin to affect health? That's basically what I learned from history, from Morris Carroll. If he, if he wouldn't realize that, but that comes back into this. And so when the British uh, epidemiologist Barker studied the population in East Anglia, in which they had marvelous records, and so he could look at early life and coronary heart disease. And it was quite clear that the conditions in early life, pregnancy, correlated strongly with whether you got an adult life coronary heart disease. That was initially poo-pooed. We now have found that confirmed totally. Mm -hmm.